This is Rachel Garceau with the Idaho News 6 forecast. Well, it is shaping up to be a really pleasant Memorial Day across the region, both in the mountains and the valleys. And as we look at some of our Memorial Day history, uh, historically in Boise, at least, these are some of the numbers. Typically, we're around 74 degrees for that average, seasonal average. Remember, we take 30-year averages, and that's where we get our average number. So 74 degrees is typically where we're at for this holiday. The hottest Memorial Day ever in Boise was back in 1887, where we saw 90 six degrees and the wettest Memorial Day ever was in 1918. Nearly an inch of rain fell that day uh, in Boise. Now we have neither rain nor intense heat coming our way today. There is some rain pushing into the Pacific Northwest. You see that big area of green making its way into Seattle and that associated plume of moisture. Some of that precipitation may sneak its way into our viewing area by tonight and into tomorrow morning. So take a look at our future cast. We'll start off beautifully sunny this morning. By tonight, though, and into early tomorrow morning, clouds will increase across the lower elevations. Our rain chances increase in the mountains as well. So over in McCall, pushing over towards Sun Valley and then up into Salmon as well. We'll likely see some off and on rain for the early morning hours of Tuesday, tapering off to just a few spot showers by the afternoon. We do stay dry, but mostly cloudy tomorrow across the lower elevations. There's a very slim chance of a quick shower moving through while we're all sleeping in the Boise area Tuesday night into Wednesday. But by the time we wake up Wednesday, most of that moisture is off to eastern Idaho. And then we start seeing sunshine and heat heat building in for the rest of the week. By Thursday, we hit the 90s, and by Saturday, we are in likely triple-digit record-setting territory. Today will be very warm, considering we only saw about 71 in Boise yesterday. We'll be pushing 80 today. We'll likely get into the 80s out in the lower Treasure Valley, but we will have those clouds on the increase as the day progresses. Winds, though, should remain relatively light, so nothing to put a damper on any outdoor barbecue plans that you might have. In Council today, the upper Weezer River Basin area in general. We'll see nice dry conditions with mid-70s there. Up near 80 in Riggins at mid-60s from McCall, Donnelly, and Cascade, with maybe not quite as much sunshine for our mountains and those showers popping up late. But before that happens, a pretty pleasant Monday. 67 for Sun Valley with morning sunshine and some PM cloud cover. 70 degrees in Fairfield with light winds and mostly sunny skies throughout the day. And just gorgeous in the Magic Valley today. 74 in Twin Falls and Shoshone. 73 in Burley with abundant sunshine and light winds. Tomorrow, copy and paste. We'll have that mix of sun and clouds with highs up around 80 degrees. And then look how our temperatures start taking off. We'll hit the low 80s on Wednesday with nothing but sunshine. Scorching Thursday with that high of 91 degrees. Look at our overnight lows, by the way, for Friday morning, Saturday morning, and Sunday morning. We'll only drop down to the mid-60s, and then we'll hit the upper 90s to likely triple digits there on Saturday. That would be a new heat record for that date in Boise on Saturday if we see that 100 degrees come to fruition. So if you haven't checked your air conditioning yet, I think this might be the week to make sure it's in good working order, Matt.